Hello everybody. Happy St. Patrick's Day. It is uh, Friday the 17th of March and I thought I'm gonna do a video solely of like dinners this next week. Um, so today I'm making beef stew. I've actually beef stew. Pot roast. What's really making pot roast today i'll show you what i have going it's been going for a few hours on low already um we had to run into town to get some things i'm wearing my green today i'll show you the back of the shirt it's got little gnomes on it it's so cute right, i'll show you what i use to put in this pot roast and i'll show you dinner when it's ready here's the back of my shirt my little gnomes so so cute i'm trying to get a good simply southern cute as that this is what is going on potatoes carrots and all of the delicious beef roast at the bottom um this is everything that i used some oregano i got the recipe offline so i don't know how it's going to taste but oregano some garlic some thyme and some rosemary a whole um 16 ounce beef broth parsley minced onion i was going to use this onion but just minced onion will work just fine and some salt i'm about to put some pepper in and get in here and break up this meat see if it's ready here is my dinner go with dinner. I already tried some. Add some Irish soda bread. This is sweet with the orange and lemon in. I'm really excited to eat this dinner. Sorry about my washer. Here is dinner tonight. It's definitely, I wouldn't even call this low carb, but my sugars have been great recently. So I'm going to have myself a little high carb meal tonight and it looks fantastic. There's the bread. I think I'm gonna melt it and put some butter on it. So excited. This was dinner tonight. We made these Irish bangers that I bought from the local grocery store. I've got some cauliflower mashed potatoes with some gravy and some dinner rolls. Tonight for dinner, I am making a Mississippi chicken. It literally is five ingredients. It's so simple. I threw in a whole packet of au jus mix a whole packet of ranch seasoning, and a whole 12 ounce jar of banana peppers. I also threw in a couple tablespoons of butter there on top, and I have four good size boneless, skinless chicken breasts in here. Um, I am gonna eat on this this week, but I'm gonna save half of it, probably freeze it, just to put in the freezer. Cause guys, I am just, I've been so tired lately. Um, I'm going to have this on high for about six hours. This should be ready to eat uh, this evening. I'm really excited. I've been craving this. And I was like, you know what? I am just going to dig the chicken out of the deep freeze and make it today. I'll show you what dinner looks like and whatever I pair it with huh, later on. All right. It is just after five and the Mississippi chicken is done. The house smells absolutely amazing. Sorry if you can hear the dryer. This is my plate. I have some of the Mississippi chicken and just some broccoli with some salt and pepper. And this is my dinner tonight. We had some burgers tonight, some bacon burgers on some pretzel buns. Delicious. I paired mine with some ruffles and some pickles and this hit the spot. Tonight we have breakfast little sliders, <laughs> um, sausage and egg and cheese on these little Hawaiian buns and I paired it with some blackberries.